Oh, there's nothing better than watching the sunrise together with you guys. I tell you, it's quite romantic, isn't it? No, it's not. I agree. <laughs> Alright, well, welcome back to another Minecraft video. I am your host, Bear Ghost of the Most, Mostus, and I just teleported to the wrong place. <laughs> I'm already failing with my new system. Okay, well, I have got some great things to show you guys this episode here. And for starters, I've been working on doing some more research. This thing here, as you guys saw last episode, the coolest thing ever. I mean, I have not had something that I like just sticking things in and repairing. I mean, look at that. Oh, God, I just love this thing. All right, so anyway, let me put all my stuff back in here. All right. So, I was working on my theory brain in a jar. I've got it up almost completely filled. I'm hoping I get this. Cross my fingers. Oh, failed. Come on. 43%? I can't read that. 43%, I think that says. Chance? Oh, there it goes. Now we're full. Now it should give me the theory or the pattern or recipe. Ta da! We have now discovered a brain in a jar. Ta da! And all you need is a brain, a piece of glass, soul sand, and a water bucket to make a brain in a jar. So let's get a bucket of water, a brain, and a piece of glass. What else can I say? It's a brain in a jar. It does occasionally whisper something useful. Maybe you should use it instead of bookcases for enchanting or research. Because they do a lot better. So what I'm going to do is we're going to break our enchanting table. Let's take these books down here. Just like so. All right, so we needed a glass. We needed a um, bucket of water. And brains. Brains, and I've got brains. Five of them right there. Very nice. I think I've got buckets right here. We'll do... four buckets of water, four pieces of glass, four brains, let's put the glass back in there, I think I've got, yeah I've only got four, so we'll put this brain back in there, I need four soul sand, so let's come into here real quick, we'll grab us some soul sand, hopefully it's close by. And absolutely nothing. <laughs> oh, what are the chances of there being absolutely no soul sand anywhere useful? For crying out loud, go figure. Oh, come on. Seriously? Not a single piece of soul sand. Honestly? Nothing? Oh, there we go. One, two, three, four. All right, four soul sand. And I gotta get back up there now. Out of my way. Okay, now that we've made our way back up here, maybe. Come on. I can do it. I did it. I'm so proud of myself. Ah, uh, yes. I'm about to accomplish and show you guys something that is just beyond. You guys are just not even going to know what to do with yourselves. That's all I've got to say about that. Alright. Let's warp back to the real world. Okay, now we need buckets of water. 
which I should. Let's see. I don't think these are infinite waters up here. No, they're not. But you know what we're going to do? We're going to just drop down below. I got plenty of water down here. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Alright, well while I'm down here grabbing water, I'm going to show you guys my newest and greatest additions to my house. And this is it. I've added an exterior room to get to my tree. Pretty neat, huh? <laughs> oh, and I've also added a dangerous mine shaft. See? Very dangerous. You never know what could be down there. Oh, one more thing. This is the coolest thing you guys are really going to like. You see this? This is my new greenhouse. You walk in through it here, and I've got harvesting seals all over the place in here for my reeds. So I'll show you guys real quick here. See these four boxes that are hovering above the reeds? There's a, a seal right there that pulls anything and everything that comes within its vicinity. So we're going to sit here for a second. Any piece of reed that grows one block any higher, just like this one and that one, watch what it does. See that? <laughs> so in essence, I can leave my guy standing here all night long, wake up tomorrow morning, and these little chests... Which one is it in? There we go. See, I've already got a stack of 64 and 8 just for me messing around. Everything that's harvested here flies right up into that. I don't even have to harvest it. I just show up, open up all these chests in the morning, and I'm going to start having a lot of paper for research. Pretty fancy little greenhouse, I must say. And these little guys here, these are the harvesters. These are what cause it to, um, to break. So like that there, these little seals will break it. And this sole, or this little thing here, see, pulls it, sucks it in, and puts it in my chest. Quite an amazing little system, I must say. Very, very productive. And I have to thank my son for that one. He's the, the genius mastermind that looked it up on the internet and got me all the stuff I needed for that. Of course, I had to go farm for some materials, though, which sucked. I went ahead and did that off off recording because I'm sure you guys don't like to see that. But I did do a bunch of mining and get some materials. I even put these pretty little flowers out here. See, I'm a natural Martha Stewart. All right, so now we are going to create our very first brain in a jar because they are much better to have around your enchanting tables than regular bookcases. So it looks like we're needing to put it in an infuser. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, let's take these out. So we need the four sands. Take these depleteds out. The four pieces of glass. The four brains. And um, let's see. What else did we need? Four all oh, the buckets of water. So bucket of water um, what am I doing wrong here it needs a bucket of, let me see go back to this bucket of water dark infusion maybe I need a different thing going on here is that what's going on let's see brains glass, soul sand, brains, glass, soul sand, and buckets of water. I'm wondering if I don't have the right... See, it says dark infusion up there. I'm wondering if I need the dark infuser. I think there's another infuser I'm going to need to make these as to why it's not working. Unless there's a certain pattern, I have to have brains, glass, and then soul sand. Let's try it. Brains, glass, soul sand. And then the bucket of water is down here. Yeah, I've got a feeling that that's exactly what we're needing is that stupid dark infuser. Gosh, dang it. That sucks. I was really hoping to make that for you guys. What a waste. 
What a waste. So now I've got to keep researching. Dang. And I broke all my bookcases. That sucks. i got to keep researching this because now that I've got it, it says I need a dark infuser in order to make this stupid brain in the jar. Well, that sucks because I don't have enough. I haven't researched it yet. Um, let's see. Forbidden knowledge. Let's try sticking this in there. 19%. It's because I don't have my bookshelves out here anymore. Oh, that backfired on me big time, didn't it? Either way, I needed to redesign this anyway. I'm going to build my my uh, Quasitum. Quasitum, however the heck you say that. I'm going to build it here, and I'm going to put all my brains in a jar once I figure that out all around it. And then I'm going to redesign this and put my enchanting table right there and put bookshelves all around that. Because I don't know if the brain in the jar does it for the uh, enchanters as well. But All right. So, yeah, at any rate, that kind of sucks. I was really hoping to do some of that researching and stuff for you guys. But at least I have this thing here. At least I've got the brain in the jar done. I just need to make a dark infuser, and I believe that you have to research that as well. Along with how I've got all these things here. Oh, that is so stupid. I swear this table irritates me sometimes. <laughs> um, let's see. Let's try one of these lost fragments and see if I can... God, these keys are killing me. 19. Yeah, that's because I don't have my bookshelves anymore out here. Alright. Not a big deal. But yeah, so at any rate, guys, I'm going to uh, just come down here and check on this thing again. Just to show you guys how productive this thing is. Look at that. See? And like I said, I'm going to leave my guy logged in overnight. When I wake up tomorrow, I should have probably... I'm hoping all my chests will be full. That would be kind of cool, man. That would be some pretty massive uh, production, paper production going on there. So let's grab some wooden planks for some bookshelves. So now we're going to come in here. We're going to create all this paper. Once we get all the paper going, then we're going to make all these books. And then, if I'm not mistaken, I've got one book there. We'll put that back. Then we can make all these bookshelves again. Very nice. Okay, ten bookshelves. Let's put these back around our little box here. They have to be one block away. Like that. There we go. Now we should be smarter. I don't think that really does much out that far. Alright, let's try this again. That went to a 20% success now. That's a 24%. Oof. Hmm. Let's try a forbidden knowledge. We're at a 20% success rate. We're going for it. Come on. Give me something. Oh, it broke it. Gotta be kidding me. Let's give it one more. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Oh, you suck. Gosh. Just give me something. Oh, my God, you guys. <laughs> oh. I swear this thing's like a gamble more than anything. Hey. I still have stuff to make bookshelves. What in the heck's going on here? It's because I ran out of wood, didn't I? Yes, I did. Nice. I made eight more bookshelves. We can give this another chance. Alright, let's see. Crucible of Souls. That's the one that's torturous. Gosh. We're just going to stick this in there. I don't want to mess with that yet. See if we can't pull something out of this. Come on. Daddy needs a new pair of shoes. Or nothing. I'll take that too. I won't like it. Come on. Give me something. Oh, for crying out loud, you suck! Come on! 
Work with me here. Oh my god. You piece of crap. Come on. <laughs> Give me something. Aha! An arcane focus fire. Nothing. And you broke my thing. I don't want that. I wanted something cool. Like... But... Oh well. Not a big deal. I'll take what I get. Give me my pork chops. Stupid machine. <laughs> Alright, well I'm going to do some redesigning around the house here. And I'm also going to use these things. So that way we can kind of start working our way towards finding that... uh. Because I've never been to that ender place before where you can go and fight the ender dragon. And I figured, you know what? We might as well start working on that as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. And hopefully we can research some more and get the dark infuser to start getting our brains in a jar. So I'm going to wrap it up here. And we'll see you guys next time. Later.